then uh, Rukshan spoke of shadows and that influence. Uh, I think this was an evolution, you know, what uh, Anand Samarakon and Sunil Shanta and, you know, Neville uh, as a guitarist and a musician, they started, it evolved from a music point of view. Um, and then, you know, Radio Ceylon had many great people amongst whom uh, Dr. Vijay Korea. By the way, the hand is broken, not him trying to play the guitar. Uh, and uh, even from a producer point of view. So the first, you know, serious producer in the country was a gentleman called Patrick Kurera, Mangon and the, uh, you know, Philips label. And it's he who really started this whole revolution. And that evolved into many other labels. And every label, like every musician and every band fed into each other, Every label fed into each other and helped each other evolve. Mama, last night I told you that I am going to tell you that this is a daily news. Okay, Uda Tiena wa ad spaces deka. Yatta Tiena tapa space ka advertise karan. Uda spaces deka the two little dog ears and Yatta Tiena na strip pad deka. So there was this period where Surya used to, you know, have that space uh, every day, and the slogan Surya used was best. You know the. Surya owned the space called Best. There was a gentleman called Shan, very, you know, witty gentleman, and he owned the strip pad at the bottom. So Shan advertised better than the best. So Surya goes as best on top and he advertises better than the best. So Matam Madaka Megunham Tata Patra and Kiola, Kiyanoa, Balanuko Muke Hati, Mume Magim Mikanakanam Kurpu Ede, and then there's a good laugh at home, and the next set of ads from Surya went as better than the very best and then Shan still goes as better than the best. So each one, you know, fed into each other and helped each other and, you know, Surya and Philips and Shan and Gemtone and New Sound and, you know, all these labels, Silverline where C.T. Fernando was the manager of, of Silverline at one point. Each one fed into each other and likewise each musician, each band, uh, you know, each group, each vocalist, uh, you know, helped each other build an ecosystem. So I think what is more important at this stage, more than Surya, um, as much as I'm very emotional about Surya and the role it played, I think what is more critical is the ecosystem that was created because that it, it, it actually created this genre called singular pop. It created bands that were, had, had a lot of singular pop musicians and created a trend which followed. I mean, you know, bands like Savages and Jetliners and, you know, Spitfires with, you know, Claude Fernando playing on that old Horner keyboard. You know, all of that influenced, uh, influenced the, the musicians and the music. So, I think Surya was just privileged to be there and thereabouts and was able to do the little bit that it did. Uh, but I think it was the ecosystem that was more important in that era. <laughs>